Oh, this one. I remember this one. Okay, we have more simultaneous blocks. As if we haven't had enough puzzles yet. But these ones aren't too bad. I do like the fact that the signs kind of have those little, like... The, that little face on them. That's pretty cool. Eh, I can't really read it from here, though. Alright, so I just do four of these. Not too hard. I mean, this is pretty much status quo here. And, whoa, what happens when we hit this fourth one? Wow, for some reason, hitting the fourth one triggers this one. Is that, is that Roy? I think that's Roy. Um, the one with the cool sunglasses. What does it say? Okay, whatever, we don't care. I do like the signs, though. It's a nice little touch. It's the little things that matter. Alright. Hello there, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a bounce on his head. Oh, darn you, cutscene. Wait, what? He, he chickened out. Um, okay. Whatever, let's move on then. Although nothing changed, I mean, we didn't technically beat him, so nothing changed. How, what? Wait, what? Was that necessary? Really? Just fight me there, come on. And here is the new mechanic of the game. So basically, when you take that main turn, so basically we have eight turns to beat him, or we get game over because the bomb will blow up, and apparently, even though we've been blown up by bombs before, we can't handle this one. I don't know. They're like super bombs. Why, why don't they just set it to zero then if it's instantly going to kill us? Once again, bad planning by the bad guys. But let's go ahead and fire, bro. Okay, I missed. Whatever. I don't know why I do this every time. It really has not been useful in the slightest. But, I don't know. It's just my strategy is always to use fire, bro, first. And this one's just poor. Oh, well, you know, it does do a decent amount of damage. Oh, are you going to do this? Are you like Ludwig? Come on, don't be a copycat. Don't be a copycat. You have nothing unique about you. Your puzzle was simultaneous blocks. Do you know how lame that is? Simultaneous blocks, really? Okay, you're actually hurting me a lot right now. I should shut up because you're kicking my ass. Jeez, that took a while. I don't think he's going to work a Thunder because I think they get immune to it now, but I might be wrong. Mm, yeah, okay, fine. Well, we're running out of time, so let's go- Oh, no! He is Thunder Thunder! Sweet! That means he dies. Well... I wish I could do more damage of that. Jeez. Ah, uh, he's gonna do this attack again. If I lose a bro here, I swear to god. Yeah, I gotta be careful here. I am getting really low on health! Oh, crap. Oh, this is bad. Okay, good. He's done. Mario, you keep falling because you have poor life. Eh, I can afford. I think I, I, think I can live. I will be fine, except I'm running out of time here. But eight turns, honestly, is more than enough to finish this guy off. Honestly, it doesn't take more than, like, two or three each time. Let's we'll go to the Chopper Bros. Our old standby. There we go. We got a combo going here. You can see his eyes through his sunglasses. He's in such pain. I keep... I, I feel like I'm saying the same thing for all these bosses. Oh, he's doing something different. Good. I can handle this. Or not. Thank God they heal you after each one. How did I miss that twice? Eh, something different. Bam! Bam! Eat my hammer! Eat it! Oh, well, okay. He's dead. I love how they explode in giant stars and the bomb runs away because it's a coward. You're a coward, Mr. Bomb. A coward. And a barrel drops. Where the barrel drops from, no one will know. Apparently, barrels just rain from the sky, and we got something new. It is the Bowser Fist. Or is it the Bowser Fang? It's the Bowser Fist, I think. No, no, it's the Bowser Fang, okay. So you get. Uh, giant counterattack, so you get a more powerful counterattack, but the loss of power is pretty big. That being said, you get 50 bro points. But, I mean, as you've seen, we've never really had a problem with bro points in this game. Unless you use it in every battle, which isn't necessary, you don't really have to use bro points that much. So, 30 bro points, honestly, don't ever put that much into it, except for maybe at the beginning, because it's not that, it's not that useful, really. Alright, so the barrel gets flown up here somehow. By the power of magical wind and of I don't know. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. But what we can do is use this to go get items. So let's go ahead and do that. An Ultra Mushroom. And this is going to fail. Damn it, you have to jump. Uh, I've been talking way too long right now. My, th my throat is totally getting really hoarse right now. So I'm sorry if I sound weird. Um, yeah. That gas is green. Kind of makes me a little worried. But yeah, we're actually almost done with this game. I'm pretty surprised. This has actually been a lot quicker than I thought it was, I guess. 
but it's been a fun project anyway. Get on the barrel! Thank you. Alright, can we just make the jump? Let's just make the jump. There we go. Alright. Get ready, get ready, go! There we go. All for a super syrup. It's not even an ultra syrup, just a super syrup. I want mega syrups. I like the word mega. Mega's a great word. I always, for some reason, I've always treated like the hierarchy, I don't even know why I did, from or from what, but I've always treated like, you know, you have like normal, then you have like a super, then an ultra, and then like mega's above ultra. I don't even know where I got that from. There's always been like the little hierarchy in my head. Maybe I'm just weird. Who knows? Let's go on. So we're at, what, six now? So this will be Wendy. I actually know that one, because she's the only woman. Oh, this one you pretty much have to fight people. There's like no way to avoid these ghosts. There's no way in hell I'm going to avoid them. Yeah. Yeah, okay, let's just go ahead and kill them all. Alright, let's see if I can actually get this without uh, fighting the other two. Probably not, but we can try it. Nope, okay, yeah, the moment you on the barrel, they can they just rush at you. Almost, I know it's possible to avoid them, but it almost is impossible. Now, the one thing I did notice the last time I fought these guys, they are weak to fire. Now, I'm not sure if they're weak to thunder or not, because they actually count as flying enemies, meaning you can't you can't hit them with your normal hand, and I think you can't hit them with Luigi's either. But they are weak to fire bros, and you can pretty much one-shot them with a normal fire bros. I don't know if you can... I wouldn't bother doing an advance, because it's best to get more damage on them because of their high defense. Because, yeah, you'll get at least 2 damage per hit, and you get, you know, 7 hits. They don't have... I think they only have, like, 12 health or something like that. So you can one-shot them every single time with that. Just some advice. Hey! We got a level... Um... Yeah, I was gonna say something I don't remember right now. Uh, so anyway, we're at HP. Um... Give me a 5. I've had such crappy level ups. Oh, come on! Really? Okay, well I have 77 now, so I guess it's okay. I guess I can accept that. Um... But yeah. They aren't too bad, I guess. Um... Yeah, I'd recommend using Fire Bros. I mentioned for the booze. That makes them a lot easier than before. Okay, 4 is a bit better than usual. We're at 77 and 88. That's pretty cool. And yeah, I actually got hit by like both of them at once, which is pretty funny. Alright, so we need that barrel. Yeah, now you should have no problem. Like, get out of here. I need to heal, actually, now that I think about it. Mario's suffering a little bit. There we go. Yeah, feel free to heal as much as you want, because, you know, this is the end of the game here. Make sure you're at good health, because these enemies are tough. I mean, they're tough on purpose. It's the last area. They're supposed to be tough. The game's supposed to get hard now. And it is, so, you know... Good job, game designers. You did well. You did well. Um, why isn't this door opening? What do I have to do? Oh, that's right. I have to do the fire here. Oh, I, do I have to bring the barrel in here, don't I? Damn it. I forgot about that. Barrel! Clever. I think this is the first time in the game you actually have to use fire while you're on a barrel. Um, yep, that is. I is there any other way? I don't remember ever having used fire on the barrel before. Maybe I'm wrong. If I'm wrong, someone correct me as usual. I mean, it's not like it's been the first time I've been wrong. Alright, get down here. Fire this thing up. Burn! That was really weird. Um, do I need the barrel anymore? No. We don't need the barrel anymore. Alright, oh, we have to do one of these two. Really, game, do you have to throw every single puzzle in the book at us? Every single one? I mean, it's fine if you don't want to throw all of them in here. You can just, you know, throw up just a few of them. Alright. Oh! You know, rocks. Sure. Okay. That's cool, too. And this is going to reverse the flow of the conveyor belt, so we have to go back the way we came. Let's go! Mario and Luigi's on a quest. We're going to kick some butt by shocking each other. Because that's what bros do. True bros love to shock each other to death. Kids, do not try this at home. It is not a good idea, damn it! Ugh. Nothing worse than just missing it by like a pixel. Typical gamer frustrations right here. Alright, let's get up here. Easy, easy, easy. Uh, I think one of these... Yeah, okay, this switch here is just gonna reverse the conveyor belt again, in case you wanna go back. In case Wendy scares you and you wanna chicken out and run away, you can do that. But I'm not scared, no Wendy. Or is this Wendy, or is this the other one? Maybe Wendy's the last one. Wendy... Nope, that's Wendy. So, yeah. Basically, we go play some Whack-A-Mole. Boom. However, if you head over here, she heads back. 
So, the way you actually want to do this, you see this gate down here? Well, you have to purposely separate the bros, and not by doing that. I always mix them up. Boom. So you separate the bros. You station Luigi over here with his hammer at the ready. You take Mario, you put his hammer on. And... Kaflaka. Nope. Come on, hit her. Ha! Oh, damn it. I was slow. Okay. Boom. Boom. Oh, wait, Luigi, you're not in position. Luigi, you've abandoned your post. Bam. And now she's pissed off. Look at how raged she is. You are uh, one ugly woman, Wendy. Look at that. That You just look like a complete total tramp. I mean, are you supposed to like represent like... Yeah, I don't even. I don't want to go there, man. You're just. You just creep me out, Wendy. You're going to burn in hell, literally, because I'm throwing fire at you. Advance. I love the little graphic for advance there. It makes me feel so special when I pull it off. And that's you know, the little things in these games that you know just make you feel good every time you accomplish something, and then make you feel like a failure every time you miss. But whatever. Yeah, she actually uses some pretty uh, different attacks, like that one. But they aren't too hard to dodge. Alright, maybe Thunder won't work on her. We'll see. Wendy's always kind of the oddball Koopa, in my opinion. She just seems different. She throws rings at you. This isn't a Sonic game. Yeah, we didn't get any defense drop on her. Whatever. Let's just wail on her. Luigi! Look at her face. Look how screwed up her stupid face is. No, 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 no. no. That, that's, that's Lemmy's thing. Can I actually use the Thunder Bros to do this? That'd be nice. I'd make for a nice use for Thunder Bros. Oh, there we go. Actually, it is a good way to deal with it, because you can see which one takes damage. The other ones don't take damage. And they also die right away. But that that's thats not the point. The point is, Thunder Bros is awesome. Multi-targeting spells for the win, or spells, bro attacks, whatever you want to call them. There we go, look at this combo. <laughs> she could not handle the Chopper Bros. Yeah, as you can see, I mean, we've been on 5-6 six, six every time with those bombs. They should not be a threat as long as you use Brotax. Even if you don't use Brotax, I'm pretty sure they're not that bad anyway. I mean, eight full turns to kill a boss that doesn't have that much health is really not a problem. Alright. If I had to use one of these Thunder Spears in a while. Go! Oh, that actually worked. Okay, good. And now we spin. Oh, there's a boo there. I remembered what I wanted to say. Which is that Boos actually only have 8 HP, so that's the amount of HP you want to do damage to them. So it takes about 4 attacks because a regular jump should do about 2 damage to them. So if you don't want to use Fire Bros, that's the best way to do it. Speaking of Fire Bros, we have to rush. Yeah, uh, go, 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 go. Fire, 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 go. Bust through the wall. Bust Luigi's head through the wall. Go, Luigi, use your head. Okay, uh, no, no, jump. Hey, first try. That's what I like to see. <laughs> Poor Luigi just gets so much abuse in this game. In every game he's in, really. Poor Luigi. And look at that, we actually separate the bros a little bit, which is, you know... I guess you could have expected one of those. You have to use these three old platforms and you have to bump under them. Cool. I mean, now we're kind of reusing mechanics, though, which is not as cool, but it still works. So, come on. Ah, there we go. And go on, Luigi. And... go. And one more. Luigi, go. Thank you. Nope, you have to go here. Okay. Nope, I'm timing this wrong here. There we go. Hit this, and... A pathway forms. So we can bring him back. And well, Actually, no, we want to bring Luigi up here. That's what we want to do. Okay. Uh, Mario, go down here. And Luigi, what do you want? Is there anything over here? Oh, there is. It's a poopy... Really? That's even, like, more useless than coins right now. At least coins you can go back and buy items. A who bean? You need, like, 15 of them to do any... Or 10, 10, 10. You need 10 of them to do anything anyway. Useless. But that's the name of the game for you. Alright, jump. I'm actually really surprised that there's actually who beans in here. That's really funny. Well played, game. Well played at how weird you are. Okay, this is my favorite little mini game of this. You have to do it with Luigi, because Luigi gets to do everything cool. Yeah, Luigi gets to get screwed over for a few times, but sometimes he gets to do some cool things. You're stuck in a barrel, and you have to essentially play Pong. We are playing Pong with a Koopaline, guys. And you guys said that the Koopalines are not any sports games. Look at that, we just beat him in Pong. Pong's not really a sport, though, but... 
It, it's it's close enough, right? All right, can we actually go with Luigi only? Nope, we have to jump up this thing. That'd be cool to fight a boss with Luigi only. Luigi can handle a Koopaling, he's cool enough. There's not even any music right now. I like how angry this guy is. Oh, you're so cute, you're so angry. Come on, let's fight. Alright, yeah we know, yeah yeah, time bomb, time bomb, time bomb. Which one are you again? You're Larry. That's that's like even, that's the most forgettable in my opinion. Let me, maybe, Larry, eh, whatever. Might as well, fire every time. I'm a fire in my fireballs. <laughs> I've just run out of things to say here. These Koopalian fights are really all the same thing. It does get a little repetitive, but you know what? The fact that they threw, decided to throw the Koopalians in this game to begin with is pretty cool anyway. There we go. It's been a while since I got that to work. Now, as you can see, he will actually... Uh, man, he looks so angry all the time. Um, he will actually play like, a little tennis match with the, uh, the fireballs. I think if they ever put a Koopalian in a Mario sports game, it should definitely be Larry, though, because he's kind of the one who does all this, like, you know, tennis and... Hey! Defense down actually worked on him. Cool. That means you get a dialogue from her. Can we get this done by seven turns? Lucky seven for the seventh Koopaline. Lucky seven for the seventh Koopaline. Okay, maybe, maybe. I'm gonna play tennis with you, buddy. Or not, because I can't do this to begin with. Let's do this. Kill him one hit. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him! Lucky seven for the seventh co uh, Koopaline. That's right. Seven, seven, seven. I'm awesome. Seven all the way. Alright. In that case, though... We are pretty much done with all the Koopalings now. Actually, we're completely done with all the Koopalings now. So we're going to head up here to one last little section. One last little climb up here. And we are here at the end of the area. One final save point, except I'm going to take a break because I've been recording for about an hour now. So next episode, the finale. The game ends. We fight Bowletta. Alright, this is Lux7DX signing out. I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.